Meanwhile, Mr. Netanyahu's big delegation includes a boy who shares a special relationship with India. Nine years after his parents were killed in 2611 Mumbai attacks, Moshe Holzberg has returned to Mumbai with his grandparents and Sandra Samuel, the nanny who saved his life. Who can forget these mind-numbing images of Nariman House from 2008 when terrorists unleashed horror on India's financial capital? And this picture of two-year-old Moshe with his nanny Sandra Samuel became the face of hope and humanity. Sandra ran out with Moshe to safety when terrorists were spraying bullets on innocent Jews. His parents were among the six people killed. Later, Moshe is back at his birthplace, accompanied by Sandra Samuels and her grandparents. Well, it's a very special day to be there and to thank God for them, but I, Moshe can come in the house and also to, to I hope they will be forever ever come over here. Those who saw Moshe grow up in front of their eyes are happy that the little boy is back. Well, I did realize that she was a little pregnant because she's taking a pregnancy walk down the street. And then I just asked her, what makes you come into this such a small byline to start a center? Well, it just happened by uh, coincidence. I said, well, that's good. That was the last time that I actually saw after 26, uh, before the 2611. Uh, post that, I never got a chance to see her. But yes, I have seen Moshe as a child because I used to see him being walked down, strolled down by the mother possibly to Gateway of India, through these bylanes, to the market. Well, they were to themselves, to be very honest, and nobody ever thought that there would be a 2611 ever happening in our lives. 18 January, a very significant day, as the Prime Minister of Israel, who is in India, will be visiting Mumbai's Kabad house, and Moshe will be accompanying him along with his grandparents. With video journalist Kanti Parmar in Mumbai, Pragya Jha, VR.